connecting two controllers or more at the same time to DJ Pro AI is super easy and it's very useful if you want to DJ with four decks or if you want to use one controller for the looper, another one for scratching, you could let your creativity run wild. So for this example, I'm using the new Mark DJ to go to touch and the Hercules DJ control mix. Now the new Mark controller is a wired controller and the Hercules is Bluetooth. So I'm going to show you that method, but you could also do it with two wired controllers. It would be the same thing, except make sure you have one of these USB hubs. So you have at least two different USBs so you can plug both controllers in at the same time. You're probably going to want to change the mapping when you're doing this because you wouldn't want two controllers doing the exact same thing. So let's plug in this Hercules controller. All you have to do is plug it into a USB-C. Boom, that's on. We're going to go middle button. MIDI devices. Bluetooth MIDI devices. And now it is plugged in. So for this example, I'm going to show you guys how to make this Newmark controller control the extra decks, deck three and four. And then we are going to use the Hercules controller like normal for deck one and deck two. So we're not going to change the mapping on the Hercules, just the Newmark. So to change the mapping on a controller what we're going to do is we're gonna press the middle button and then we're gonna go to our settings and then now we are gonna go down to midi devices and then here we're gonna see both controllers so we have the control mix down here we're not gonna change that mapping but we're gonna change the mapping for the new mark dj to go to touch so this is the original mapping that it's going to start with. So if you look at the controller, it's moving deck one, deck two, and deck one, deck two. We want to make it deck three and deck four. So we go back to where we were. Mini devices, DJ to go to touch. And then in order to change a button or knob or jog wheel, all you have to do is touch the button that you want to change or the knob. So I'm going to touch this jog wheel. So it says deck one scratch. I'm going to change that from deck one scratch to just simply deck three. And then we're going to touch the other one. And then this is going to be deck four. So now here we go. So this is deck one deck two, and then deck three, deck four. And where'd my deck go? So you see all of these decks are now controlled by the controller. I am gonna change these pads. I'm gonna have them control the looper. So right now they control the sampler if I selected it on the pad mode. So let's change it to the looper. So we press one, one. one button one. there. Instead of looper, we're going to go, we're gonna go from sampler to looper. Action, trigger, track one, trigger, sample two. I'm just doing it randomly. Break it down. Break it so down. Looper. Track two. Boom. Go, DJ. Looper. Go, DJ. So here's a little scratch routine I would do if I set the controller up like this. So I'm going to scratch with the Hercules controller, and then I'm just going to set a looper on the new mark. So you could use two controllers to DJ with DJ Pro at the same time with both controllers. Or you could use a really cool feature that is built in to DJ Pro AI, which is Ableton Link. So if we press the middle button and then settings and we turn on Ableton Link, we could use another app such as the Launchpad or Remix Live. For this example, let's use Remix Live. So now we're in Remix Live. 
and I'm going to turn Ableton Link on to this. Settings. Ableton Link. Enable. So now it is synced to both. So now one controller is controlling this other app at the same time as I can DJ with the Hercules controller using it as just DJing. So you could just DJ with the Hercules controller and then you can be setting loops and doing a lot of stuff with Remix Live. So if you guys wanna learn how to use Ableton Link with DJ Pro AI, you could watch one of the videos up there. Or if you wanna learn how to map controllers with the Remix Live app, you could watch that one as well. Thanks for watching.